Question 1. Construct triangle ABC given measure of angle A 60 degrees, B 30 degrees and AB measures 5.8 cm. In this question, the aim is to construct a triangle ABC where measure of angle is 60 degrees. So we will write the same and measure of angle B equals 30 degrees. And the line given to us AB measures 5.8 cm. Well, in this, we are studying angle side angle criteria of congruency of triangle. That is, if we are given with two angles of a triangle and a side that lies between those angles, then we can construct a triangle which will always be congruent to its counterparts with same dimensions. Well, if you observe here, you are given with two angles of a triangle and you can easily find the third one. So the question may not give you side between two angles. It can be anywhere. But if two angles are given, then you can find out third angle with the help of angle sum property of a triangle. That is all the angles within a triangle measures 180 degrees, which we will see in questions as well. So steps of constructions are simple. Number first, we will draw a line segment. The only line segment given to us is of 5.8 centimeter. So we will name AB. And again, as we used trick in our previous exercise, that is of side angle side. In this, we can also use another way to find whether angle side angle criteria is there or not. So first of all, you have to observe line segment. This is AB. Therefore, both angles A and B are given. Thus, we can conclude that this triangle will be constructed under the criterion of angle side angle. So first is done 5.8 centimeter using ruler and name these points as AB. B. At point A, we will draw an angle that is angle YAB equals 60 degrees. So you know very well how to draw it with the help of compasses. Just draw a semicircle like this and do not change the radius of the needle here wherever it cuts here on this line segment AC that will be your 60 degrees and extend it with the help of ruler till Y and then C part at point B you have to draw 30 degrees well again by using the same principle first draw a semicircle like this and then with the same radius put your needle here and cut wherever it cuts then put the needle here and cut here and then put here and cut like this so it will be angle bisection of this 60 degrees that will give you 30 degrees so we need not to discuss it again and again because we have already studied and did such type of questions many number of times before now d a y and b x intersect at point c well we don't have to use any compasses because these lines will themselves intersect to give you the remaining two line segments. In this way, we construct the triangle. That is your question number first. Question second. Construct triangle PQR if PQ measures 5 cm and angle Q measures 105 degrees, angle R measures 40 degrees. Hint. Recall angle sum property of a triangle. Here, the aim is to construct a triangle PQR where measure of angle P is 35 degrees. It is not given in the question, but we will find it out. What the question has given us are two angles, namely PQR and QRP, or we can say angle Q and angle R. But line segment is of PQ. So Q is there, we don't have P. We have R, but we know that all the three angles will measure up to 180 degrees. So 105 plus 40 is 145 and 180 minus 145 is 35 degrees. Therefore, we have written measure of angle P equals 35 degrees. Then angle Q is given to you as 105. Why we haven't taken this thing? Because we must have P and Q since we are using angle side angle criteria of congruence of triangles in order to construct this triangle. Therefore, hint was also given that recall angle sum property. That is all the angles within a triangle measures 180 degrees and obviously PQ is 5 cm. Now the steps of construction are same as we had in our previous question. So first of all we will draw a line segment of 5 cm where we have PQ as our extreme points of this line segment. Then B at point P we will draw 35 degrees with the help of protractor. How we can make it? 
just put this reference point this is your reference point put it here and this horizontal line that is zero degree line should fall completely on this line segment pq and here you have to study inner degree matches so 30 is here 35 will be here this is your 35 so this is your 35 and you you just put point here and then with the help of ruler draw a line segment px that is your 35 degrees now doing the same thing but at point q q says 105 degrees so put this point here and this line should be falling on line segment pq and 135 now you will read exterior points so this is 100 this is 110 this will be 105 so put point here and with the help of ruler make it so why haven't we taken inside ones because you know if you do so then 105 will be something like this if you would take inner measures then we will not have third angle which will add up to 180 degrees so keep that thing in mind as well so that is your c now you don't have to do anything you just mark the point where both line segments intersect no calculations needed and that will be your vertex r and thus your triangle is completed so therefore it is the required triangle pqr and that is your d step that makes your question number second question third examine whether you can construct triangle def such that ef measures 7.2 centimeter measure of angle e equals 110 degrees and measure of angle f equals 80 degrees justify your answer so if you try to construct this triangle then it will be something like this you are given with ef 7.2 centimeter so you took two points ef and 7.2 centimeter as a line segment and at e you are given 110 degrees you construct 110 degrees using protractor put the reference here match horizontal zero degrees here and wherever it falls it will be your 110 degrees and angle f is 80 degrees so 90 is something like this so 80 will be somewhere here so it will make a line segment like this so what will be angle d in this case he will be zero degrees which is not possible why because only two angles only two given angles adds up to 190 degree which is not possible because all the angles measures 180 degree and here two angles are measuring up to 190 degree therefore if we justify this answer that is sum of angles of a triangle matches 180 degrees therefore this triangle is not possible well if you take this case this is your diamond necklace and any triangular shape of such kind will always add up to 180 degrees in this case it appears to be isosceles that is this angle measures this angle so therefore all the three angles will add up to 180 degrees so take any triangle in this world the sum of measures will be equal to 180 degrees else we will not be able to construct the triangle as we have in this question so that is the last question question number third